Hello and welcome to a Jaren134 video and in this video <clears throat> I'm going to be showing you how to get the closest thing to 4.2 jelly bean on a 2.3 point whatever device you have because it goes as high as 2.3.6 so whatever 2.3 device you have I'm going to show you how to get the closest to 4.2 jelly bean features and look and feel as possible. Let's get into the video. So as you can see, my device has the jelly bean dock with jelly bean style icons or ICS, whichever one you want to call it because they look basically the same. Now, to get the look and feel, which is the dock and the circled folders like you see here to get all of that you're going to want to go to the play store because this is where most of your downloads are going to come from once you've entered the google play store you're going to want to go to the magnifying glass at the top right of the google play store and you're going to want to type in go launcher and you just search for Go Launcher, and when Go Launcher appears, which is Go Launcher EX, it will look like this. Yours will not say open, it will tell you you can install it, and you go ahead and install that. And once you have downloaded Go Launcher EX, when you press the home button, you'll get a menu that looks like this. You're going to want to not hit the checkbox right away because there's more to this. You just want to go ahead and click on Go Launcher EX, and you're taken to the Go Launcher Home, which in my case I already have the jelly bean theme applied for you you will automatically be taken to the UI 3.0 which will look like this and it will have this background and the icons will not be like they are now or any of that I've already organized my icons while I like them, but this is pretty much what it would look like for you. So, once you have uh, gotten Go Launcher installed, you're going to want to go to the Play Store and type in Jelly Bean Go Launcher. And you'll find one that says Jelly Bean Go Launcher Theme. And it has a pink little icon as it's what it displays for it. And... You just go ahead and install that, and it shows you the pictures of what it looks like. And then when you get done, you're going to want to back all the way out of this Play Store. And when you're taken to the home screen again, you're going to want to hit the menu function key on your uh, phone. And then you want to go right over here. See if that focuses. Uh, focus! Hello! Well, anyway, you're going to want to click on the little uh, thing that looks like paints and things and says themes on it. And when that opens up, you're going to want to go over to the installed section from the top little tab thingies. And then you'll see Smooth Jelly Bean, which was the Jelly Bean Go Launcher you downloaded because it has the pink backdrop. Just like the picture on the Play Store did. So you're going to want to click on that and then click Apply. And then all your icons and things should automatically switch to 4.2 Jelly Bean style. Okay, yeah, see, maps changed over. Okay, everything's changed over. Now, to get the notification uh, pop up thing you like you see here on my Facebook, you're going to want to go back to the Play Store and type in Go Note notifications typing go notifications and it should be the top option go notifications it tells you what it does you can download install it's free and you're all good to go now once you've gotten go notifications installed you need to go to your menu key and then you need to go through the uh, min the selections down here because you can go from left to right and look for notifications Click on notifications and under that it's going to ask you about turning on accessibility and some other stuff. And 
and you turn on accessibility and then whatever applications you have installed you can get notifications for them such as it allows notification um, notification number pop-ups for Twitter Facebook Messenger Instagram and Facebook I don't know what other applications are supported right now besides these main ones that are obviously automatically going to be supported I don't know what other um, Google Play downloaded applications are supported as of yet because I only have these that it's telling me it can support. So there's that and then to get the 4.2 camera which I'm going to show you here this is the 4.2 Jelly Bean camera it even includes a panoramic mode recording and boy I just took a picture Wow. Anyway, it includes flash and white balance controls and all these other things that the 4.2 Jelly Bean camera does include. Now, how do you get the 4.2 Jelly Bean camera? Or the ICS camera because they're kind of pretty much the same. Okay, you want to go to the Play Store. And in the Play Store, you're going to look up ICS camera camera ICS my bad sorry and it is a free application that includes ads on it most unfortunately but there is a pay version and camera IC camera ICS plus it cost I think a uh, dollar 99 or 99 cents and it just basically removes the ads for you but if you want the panoramic and you want the different camera settings that are not found in 2.3.6 but they are found in 4.0 and 4.2 this is the best way to get them use the ICS camera and you'll have those functions available to you without having to get a 4.2 device now to get the Jelly Bean lock screen you're going to want to go to the Google Play Store once again, and this time you're going to want to type in, swoosh, spinning crap around, go locker, go lock, hello, C-K-E-R, go locker, click on go locker, which is the green little lock icon thingy, install it, and you will now have a way to change your lock screen. Now, to get the Jelly Bean lock screen after you've installed GoLocker, clearly, you're going to want to type in Jelly Bean Jelly Bean GoLocker. When that appears, you want to select the first option since it is free. It is the closest to the Jelly Bean and ICS GoLocker, but the one that I have is Jelly Bean GoLocker, this one. This one costs a dollar to get, but as you can see here, it gives you a high definition look version of the Jelly Bean Locker. So, yeah. Now, to apply the locker that you've downloaded, you're going to want to go all the way back by hitting the backup button to get to the home screen. Then you're going to want to push the house button, which is your home button. Now, this time you want to check the use by default for this action so that you're no longer hassled with it and it will appear that you are running on a Jelly Bean device because you're not seeing the pop-up notification telling you that it is a app. This time you're going to want to select Go Locker and for good reason. Go Launcher will still be your default home screen setup dilly thing but Go Locker has to be selected so that Go Launcher and Go Locker can work in conjunction to make Go Locker and Go Launcher not crash. So, now that you've selected the default action and chose Go Locker, you need to go to your menu button and scoot over on the little pop up Go Launcher menu and choose Go Locker. Under Go Locker, you're going to want to go to the tabs across the top and choose Installed. Under installed, you're just going to select the one you want and hit apply. It will be applied and you will be able to just back right out of this. And when you push your lock button and wait an amount of time, when you unlock it, you'll see you now have the lock screen of your desired choice that you downloaded. 
and you can go into the settings in Go Locker as well as Go Launcher, just like you would your normal home launcher that was already installed on your phone, and change the wallpaper to anything you want. You don't have to be stuck with this smooth pink crap if you don't want to. So, huh, that's how you make your phone be a 4.2 Jelly Bean device without actually having 4.2 Jelly Bean installed. So, for more videos like this, click the like button. It shows that you're interested and you want to see more. Hit subscribe and you'll be able to see more videos. Like me on Facebook. And you have a great day because I think this video has went on long enough. But now you know how to get Jelly Bean 4.2 if you do not have a 4.2 device. So you have a great day and I'm out.